Beijing Winter Olympics 2022 to see artificial snow val. For the 2022 Snowy Olympics, Beijing will be transformed into a winter paradise. Due to climate change, the international sports events will be covered nearly completely in artificial snow. According to a paper co-authored by Georgia State University, the meteorological phenomena has resulted in shorter winter seasons, less snowfall, and melting ice, which has resulted in the games employing synthetic snow. Scientists have devised a means to produce artificial snow particles to create the appearance of a winter environment in locations where the weather is unpredictable and snow is not always readily accessible. However, the delusion has a price. According to the article, the games will need around 49 million gallons of water, 130 fan-driven snow generators, and 300 snow-making guns to generate the 1.2 million cubic meters of fabricated snowflakes. According to Georgia State Assistant Professor Tim Kellison, in order for things to go as well as it can, event organizers must have the capacity and the resources for water and electricity. The artificial snow still has to be kept in perfect circumstances by good weather, since even full snow evaporates. Athletes are also concerned about the perils of man-made snow, and the effect is being seen. Biathlon on artificial snow, according to Estonian Olympic biathlete Johanna Talaham, is very dangerous. It's quicker and more hazardous because it's icier, she said. When you fall outside of the course, it also hurts more if you land on rocky and muddy hard ground, rather than soft snow, she noted. Using artificial ice is more efficient since it has a greater moisture content. The imitation flakes may also cause dangerous accidents when going downhill, since they speed things up. It can be pretty hard out there, and falling on concrete feels like falling on ice said Chris Grover, the U.S. ski team's lead cross-country coach. Environmental problems and potential Olympic host cities should be given greater consideration when selecting prospective destinations for the Games in the future, according to Kellison's assessment. The Olympics will run from Friday, February 19 through Sunday, February 20.